ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Dragon Quest XI, as I continue this blind let's play. Last time, we won the, the tournament, and went underneath the caverns and then claimed the reward. Uh, or tried to, let me put it that way. Um, Jade and Rab uh, actually took the, uh, the rainbow and headed for the ruins of Dundrasil. And so we're about to head that way. I've actually just thought about it. Yes, we have quite a bit of money. Um, <clears throat> after, excuse me, after doing that. So I'm going to head over here uh, and just double check the shops before we head that way. Just to make sure. I'm tempted to buy this headband. Um, let me just double check. I don't know. Maybe not. Um, and I'm not going to make the same mistake and buy that great sword, but I'm just going to double check to see what else uh, they have. Yeah, it even says great swords. My goodness. I can't believe I didn't see that last time. Um. Hmm. I'm tempted to get this for Veronica. Hmm. You know what? I think it actually be fine. Because I just thought about it. If we're leaving here, um, we can go to that other town that's uh, across the way at some point. And I think that had uh, better items. So, yeah. So, without further ado, let us start heading towards the ruins of Dundrasil. My, uh, my hometown, or home city, or however you want to say it. Is anybody close to leveling? No, so let's just go. We might run into a few encounters along the way, but I'm just kind of eager to, to get there and, and see what happens. Um, Because it's kind of funny that Rab and Jade both recognize the Mark of the Luminary. Kind of same with Veronica and uh, Serena. Um, and of course, Sylve, for that matter, you know, same... Uh, it's, you know, it begins, like, it, or we're going where it all began, or, you know. And so I'm wondering if he knows a lot more than he's letting on. Uh, let's go up here first. Yeah, that's probably best to go, go here first. Okay, we're not going to jump down there just yet. I was just checking out, seeing where that path went. Uh, is there a chest up here? Doesn't look like it. Oh boy. Hang on. Oh no. We'll see how bad these guys are. They, uh, they're not that bad. Alright. There is a chest, though. Okay. Let's, uh, start making our way around, then. I wonder if I can jump off. I doubt it. Nope. Darn it. Can I... How about here? Nope. Well, time to go around. Well, unless... No, hang on, hang on, hang on. That looks like there's a spot. Oh, it's above us. It doesn't look like there's a path up. Could be over there. Hang on. I might actually I might need to take control of them. Let's try it. Hang on. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah. Veronica wins again. Okay, let's ride him. No, don't attack. No, no. I hope I didn't just lose that them out. Want some. <laughs> yeah, let's go. There's no way up. Dang it, really? Hmm. Oh well. I might just be missing it, but we'll, uh, we'll head around. I'm really liking this, uh, this area in general. It's really nice. Okay, is there any way to get up there? There has to be, but I'm probably just overlooking it. Oh my goodness. Um, hang on. I'm gonna admit, I feel pretty, pretty silly right now. Hang on, let's, let's dismount. Well, shoot. I really don't know. So, in that case, I'm not going to worry about it just just right now. We're gonna we're gonna continue on. And you know what? I don't know if I've talked to the party yet. That old guy played us, man. And we fell forward hook, line and sinker. The rainbow was just bait. He's just trying to he's just trying to lure you to him, easy. Look, don't ask me why, but I bet I'm right. Come on, let's head west to Dundrasil and find out what's going on. <laughs> I had enough of this. Just when it looks like the rainbow's ours, it gets snatched away at the last minute. First the Sultan sells it to the sum merchant. And it gets stolen in the Octagonia. It hurts to think of how much time we spent trying to track this stupid thing down. You think it's cursed or something? I mean, it could be. Come and meet me in Dundrasil. I have something to show you. That's what the letter said, isn't it? I wonder what it could mean. Or what it, what it could be. My goodness, I'm sorry. I mean, Dundrasil has been reduced to ruins. What could someone have shown us there? Why would old Rab tell you to meet him in Dungeon Can he really just have chosen your hometown by chance? No. Well, I suppose there's only one way to find out. Let's get moving. Oh man, look at this. This is a shot right here. With the waterfall. Awesome. And then there it is. Dundrasil. Home sweet home! Oh, hey! Let's try this guy. Okay. Goodness. I haven't commented on this. Nice. Um, but I just, I love the fact that every time we get in battle, and it's actually in the region, you know, and it shows the region around us, I, I, I just love it. Okay, it looks like it's a camp, but also probably some goodies on this side. Yep, there's one. 
There's another one off in the distance. Soak Blossom. Very fluff. Butterfly Wang. Anything? No? Alright. I'm guessing to get to that uh, island with the get one of those creatures again. Yeah, probably so. We'll see. I'm gonna, I'm gonna avoid the ruins of Dundrasil right now and actually go down south and explore that right before I head there. Speaking of, let's go up here. One of the little ghost buddies up there. Um, I thought there would have been a ladder. Hang on. Maybe not. Okay, interesting. I'm kind of curious to know what's going to be the backstory behind all this. Like, what what was like the main reasoning of the destruction of Dundrasil, or you know that kind of thing. Okay, I doubt I can cross this on foot. Nope, cannot. Oh, hang on. Oh, hey, buddy. Master Luminary! You'll never believe the hijinks involved in getting my mitts on the password. Well, let me to regale you with the... Uh... Oh, another time, you say. Yes, of course. Well, there you go. So that's the third or fourth one I found. The Rainbow Mines. Interesting. Don't know, uh... Again, don't know which Dragon Quest that's supposed to be, but... Rod of Rapidity. Uh, let's... I'm guessing it's for Veronica. Oh, heck yes. Well, after finding that, I'm glad I didn't spend any money back in, uh... Octagonia. Alright. So, yeah, we're not gonna go there just yet. We're gonna keep going. Let's check out these guys. Wait, those are orcs? Interesting. That's a new take on them. They kind of hurt, though. Uh, let's heal up Serena. I really don't want her to go down again and lose experience. Nice. You did. Oh, it's an enemy. And it looks like there's one of those locked doors over there, so we'll, uh, at some point come back for that. Anything down there? Doesn't look like it. Oh, hang on. What about here? Here we go. Seed of life. What does that do? Increases HP. Who needs that the most? Um, let's see. 149, 151, 98. Ooh. I'm gonna give it to Veronica, I think. 
Oops, hang on. Save your life. There you go. Nice. That's the skill points. Uh, hang on, do I have any other seeds? Doesn't look like it, unless I'm overlooking it. Oh! This is magical mending. Okay. Yeah, so let's look at this. 60. No, we're not going to give it to Eric. Zero. Uh, 25. I'm going to give it to myself. I think I'm going to give it to myself. Uh, where is it? There it is. Yes. That's fine. Oh no. Woo! That was close. Anything over here? No. Okay. Oh, wait. No, never mind. Looks like there's a church or something down this way. We'll uh we'll check it out. Then we'll circle back around to Dungeon Sill. A little log cabin, that okay. Nice. Yeah, let's grab that item, then circle. Oh, goodness. I, uh, should have turned the camera more, but oh well. Let's finish them off. Told you I was tough. There we go. Learn sizzle. I'm trying to think, have I gotten sizzle yet? Um, hang on. Wait, was it sizzle? Or si or yes, there it is. Friends group enemies, awesome. So just like a uh, improved version of Sizz, it looks like. And it might be able to hit more enemies as well, so we'll see. Okay, anything down over here? So far, it doesn't look like it. Yeah, frankly, I would have put something back in that spot, but that's just me. Here we go. Mini metal. I still need to figure out what they're for. At some point I will. At some point I will. Just not not yet. Hello? Anybody home? Okay. Frankly, a cutscene might happen there later. I don't know. I, the reason I say that, I just find it strange, you know, to have this all the way out here without using it, but I don't know. We'll see. Another reason I, I think that is because there's a save point right by here. Um, I don't know. We'll see. 
Time to go to Dungeon Cell. Enough wasting time. Everybody healed up? Uh, not quite. Okay, that's good enough. I think after I get done with this region, I think I will head back to the bandits. I would think we're high enough level to take them out, finish up that quest. Um, I know there's a few quests I've... Whoa, where am I going? Um, that I've kind of passed up or just kind of let slide, but... Um, I might come back and try to finish those off. We'll see. Uh, the, the main ones I'm really not too worried about are the ones that are trying to use the, the pet powers. But that's that's about it. There we go. All right. Well, I guess welcome home. We'll see what happens. Man. So this is Dundrasil. I'd heard the rumors about what happened here, but still, I never expected this. To think that not so very long ago, this was one of the world's great cities, and that it was reduced to rubble in a single night. The king and queen murdered by monsters. The princess of Heliodor, too. The poor thing was only visiting. Oh, but I don't need to tell you this. They were your parents, after all. So where's the old guy from the tournament, anyway? And why'd he drag us all the way out here? <gasps> Look! Those torches are lit! He must be in there somewhere, waiting for us! Ooh. Wonder if we can face that thing. Hmm. Um. Yeah, I'm about to level. Let's try it. Green Dragon. Ow. Oh my gosh. Really? Um... Well... I don't think we have anything to bring her back. We could flee. Oh my goodness. Um... Let's just let's just try to finish the fight. My only reservation with this is I have to go all the way back to the church to resurrect people. Ooh. That's really my own uh, main reasoning behind it. Come on, let's finish him off. Actually no, I changed my mind. Let's heal up Veronica. Ouch. Oh my gosh, Eric. Easy peasy. Well, alright, Silvando so increases though. Oh my goodness. Let's, oh that's right, there's a camp right there. Let's go back to camp really fast, then we'll explore. Forgive me, I'm so sorry. Hang on. Cause yeah, she she didn't get anything. 
Same with Eric. Goodness, I was doing so well with ev keeping everybody, uh, you know, in the party-wise like, experience. Oh well. And besides, uh, we'll be switching people in and out, so... Here we go. Ooh, don't save. Not yet. Hang on. Resurrection. Yeah! Okay. Now let's save. Alright, now let's go explore. Oh, hang on. Uh, Dungeon Sill and meet up with them. You know, thinking about it, since Reb, you know, is an older man, I wonder if he was uh, there during the attack. There's the dragon. I'm not facing him again. Okay, doesn't look like anything's in there. Oh, good there. Okay, let's go to this side. Dragon hide. Probably make, uh, I'm guessing like dragon armor, dragon weapons. But that's coming up. Oh, dang it, come on. Oh, here we go. Yeah, here we go. Dragon scale. Oh, dang it. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Seriously? Yeah, please get her up. Oh, you missed. I'm gonna just attack. He's gonna die. Yep, he died. Dang it. Another one bites the dust. Oh well. I forgot. Um, Serena can uh, get people up now. Right? Um, yes. And then healer. Thank goodness. Uh, hi. Please don't hurt me. I'm not a bad slime. If you promise not to hurt me, I'll tell you something su surprising. This well goes all the way to the castle. You can't lose it to get there. <laughs> oh my goodness. Where the brazen things are. Okay. Let's go down then. Okay, just double checking to see if there's any chests. There he is. <laughs> 
So you made it at last. Is it just you? Where's your friend, the girl? Hmm. She has duties to attend to. She'll be glad you came, though, as am I. It's not like we had much choice. Now, where's the rain bow? We need it. Oh, you do, do you? Yeah. I suppose that's because your pal here's the luminary. <gasps> Wait. How could you? I thought you died years back, laddie. When I saw that mark in your hand at the tournament, my heart skipped more than a few beats, let me tell you. Now, come along. There's something I want to show you, if you'll indulge an old man for a wee while. Okay. Where are we going, Rab? Oh my goodness, Rab, I'm not gonna... Here. I'm not gonna walk all the way. We're just gonna run. Aye, this place brings back some memories, sure enough. Look, are you going to tell us who you are, or what? I'd already given up most of my duties by then. I spent most of my days in the city enjoying my retirement. Oh, we had us some fun. <laughs> and then the monsters came. And I lost everything. When I was your age, laddie, this was one of the finest cities you could ever hope to see. And look at it now. One night. That's all it took them to tear it all apart. Ugh. Just listen to me blethering on. I, I was going to show you something, wasn't I? Come on. Alrighty. Mm -hmm. Is this somebody's grave? Aye. This is where the king and queen of Dundrasil are buried. You mean... Mm. I do. This is your parents' grave, laddie. The grave of my daughter and son-in-law. Oh, man. Wait, but that would mean you're his grandfather. These two fine young souls died, and I survived. I came to believe there must have been a reason for that. That someone had a purpose in mind for me. So I set out to learn why Dundrasil was destroyed. I've been on the road ever since. Good to meet you, Grandpa. I've uncovered some of the truth on my travels. It was King Carnelian, you see. He... changed. He once believed in the power of the Luminary more than any of us. But he became convinced that you were evil. That you were the dark spawn. Ah, he's not a man I knew any longer. Folks say he blames you for everything, even the death of his daughter. How could you, old friend? There's something behind it all. The fall of Dundrasil, the change in my old comrade. I promise you, I will find out the truth. Erwin, I found 
I found your boy. He was not lost to us after all. <laughs> You're alive, laddie. Against all the odds and... And now you're home. You've no idea how many times I've dreamed of this day. I never thought it would actually come. Now, will you humor an old man a while longer? There's an old royal ritual, you see. It's to send the souls of the departed to a better place. I'd like you to help me perform it. Let's do it. There's an altar up in the hill behind the castle. I'll be waiting for you there. Yeah, I didn't think I, uh, would run into my grandfather, but, uh, yeah, we'll see where this goes. Love the music, by the way. Hey, Jade. Everything's ready. Thank you, Princess. It looks just perfect. Where is she the princess from? That's what I want to ask. standing back here with me. Only members of the Drusillian royal family may perform the ritual. How come he called you princess? Are you? Quiet now. The ritual is about to begin. I'm gonna take that as a yes. You just follow my lead. All right, laddie. You got it. The souls of those who depart this life must all return to Yggdrasil. One life for each leaf of the great world tree. But those taken by monsters cannot return of their own accord. So our ancestors devised a ritual to send them on their way. The smoke guides them back to where they belong. To Yggdrasil's bosom. Oh, it's that theme again. Each butterfly is a lost soul, and now they can all be at peace. That is so many. Oh, wow. You didn't die in vain, Eleanor. You saved your boy. And the princess. It was a noble sacrifice you made. Thank you, my beautiful girl. And goodbye. I hope you don't mind me asking, but your mother didn't leave you anything, did she?
as he hands over the letter. Oh, no. She didn't, did she? So this letter's why you went to see King Carnelian, eh? Oh. If only she'd known. I'm sorry, laddie, you've been through so much. But I suppose if you'd not set out for Heliodor, the journey would never have led you to me, eh? Oh, Heliodor. <laughs> Sorry, Laria. I'm going to need to be alone for a wee while. Things would be a lot easier if we could just fly up to Yggdrasil like those butterflies. Sorry, now's not the time to be saying silly things like that, is it? It's alright. It's alright, Monica. I think I figured out who that girl is. It's kind of hard to believe, though. Wasn't the Queen brave, rescuing you the way she did? Veronica and I learned from her example, after all. After all, it's our job to protect you now. What's up, Syl? Oh, darling. That ceremony was just beautiful. Your parents are at peace now, I'm sure. Lady Elena. Who's there? You weren't supposed to see that. There's no shame in crying. There really isn't. I was just thinking about Lady Eleanor. I... I mean, your mother. Why don't we take a little walk? Sure. My mother was a rather sickly soul, by all accounts. She died not long after I was born, so in a sense, Lady Eleanor was the only real mother I ever knew. She used to read me stories, take me flower picking. I loved her so much. You know, was she... was Jade the, the, the younger girl in the... in the beginning? Unless that could have been somebody else, but we never actually saw her die. Hmm. Something to think about. You can imagine how happy I was when I heard she was having a baby. I couldn't wait to meet my little brother. I think she is. You know, it was raining like this the last time I ever saw her. I can't believe how much time has passed. Since... Hmm? Whoops, I didn't mean to skip that. Wait, up there. <laughs> Something tells me they're looking for you and your friends. And there's only one kingdom that can send that many soldiers out on a manhunt. Heliodor. Come on. We need to get back to the others. Hmm. Let's do it. Oh, and it's just me. Okay, well, me and her, but... Yeah. from the altar. No sign of them. What about the Darkspawn? No sign of him either. Blast! They must have gone away. It, it's him! 
<gasps> He's over here! The dark spawn is over here! Oh, for goodness sake. <laughs> 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 What shall we do with the girl? Sir Hendrik's orders were to bring the Darkspawn back alive. He never said anything about anyone foolish enough to side with him. Just you try it. <laughs> nice. Take her on alone. Sir Hendrick! Sir Hendrick! Come on. We'll head around the mountain and meet up with the others before he gets back. If he's calling out Sir Hendrick, that means most likely Sir Hendrick is nearby. I don't like that. Speaking of... I had a feeling. I have you at last, Darkspawn. There is nowhere left to run. You are a slippery one, I will give you that. I had not thought you would make it this far after I picked up your scent in Octagonia. <laughs> Men, the Darkspawn is mine. Deal with the girl. Forward! <laughs> this is all the dreaded child of darkness can muster. Pathetic! Darkspawn, the chase ends here. Oh, what timing. No! Hold on! Princess! I won't let you go again. Looks like that log cabin. I had a feeling a cutscene would play here. Oh good, you're awake. <laughs> Where's she? I'm soaked through. Let's get warmed up, shall we? I'm glad I caught you. I couldn't have forgiven myself if... if it happened again. I suppose Rad must have told you about your mother, that she sacrificed herself to save you and the Princess of Heliodor. Well, you've probably worked it out for yourself already, but... I was that princess. 
Your mother saved my life. That night, the night Dundrasil fell, we ran from the castle, but the monsters were too fast. She handed you to me and distracted them for long enough for us to get away. She died to save us. But even though she trusted me with you, I... I was too weak and stupid to... I fell in the river and... I let you go. I can't tell you how many times I've wished that it was you rabfished out of there and not me. After he found me, we headed back to Heliodor. We thought my father might help us to find you, but when we got there, we found out he was telling people I'd been killed by the Luminary. He was trying to make people believe awful things about you. Brab was convinced that he wasn't in his right mind, that someone must be controlling him. So we set out together to find out who and why. I never expected to see Hendrik again, let alone on the battlefield. We were lucky to get out of there alive. like the rain's dying down. We should head back to Dundrasil. I just want to say that was awesome. So yeah, Princess of Heliodor. Makes sense. I left you once, Easy, and I swear I'll never do that again. I owe it to Lady Eleanor. Now, come. We must rejoin Rab and the others before Hendrik and his men find us. Let's head back to the ruins of Dundrasil. Let's first save, just to be safe. Alright. Ladies and gentlemen, I think this is where I'll end this episode. I really liked what uh, the cutscenes that just happened. They were really awesome. So, and I'm looking forward to continuing this journey and seeing where this leads. As always, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching and tuning in. Wherever you are, have a good day, have a good night, and take it easy out there.